we are here in uh, Westside Boxing Gym in South um, London with head coach John Holland. Um, how are you, John? Yeah, I'm very, very well, thank you, Michael. Very well. Um, so, um, John, when was this uh, gym established? Uh, when did you start it, basically? Uh, we opened the gym in 2003, so we've been going 11 years now, just over 11 years. Uh, Audley Harrison, the ex-gold medalist Olympian in the Sydney Games of 2000, he come down and kindly opened the gym for us on the opening night. And uh, we started with two nights a week, and now we're running pretty much seven days a week, near enough. Um, okay, um, so if you can tell us where is this um, fabulous old school boxing gym located? We're located in West London, halfway between um, Central London and Heathrow, near uh, the famous Twickenham rugby ground. Just, um, yeah, just yeah, on, on West London, basically. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very good connection from, from all of the city. Um, the gym is, is located outside of Hanslow um, train station. Um, so when are the sessions and how long you know, it lasts and w what's the price for, um, for a session? And uh, the sessions run from Sunday to Thursday, the open gym sessions. The uh, Sunday morning, we open at 10 in, in the morning and we close at 1 o'clock in the afternoon, 1 p.m. On Monday and Wednesday, we have the children's nights. Um, that's early on the Monday and Wednesday. That's from 4.30 till 6.30 p.m. And then after that on the Monday and Wednesday, we have the adults running till 9.30 p.m. On a Tuesday and Thursday, we run the adult sessions from 3.30 in the afternoon until 9.30 in the evening. Um, that's important as well. Um, there is no membership fee if you want to join this, uh, this gym. There's no contract. Um, it's strictly six pounds per session. Um, um, John, um, can you tell us more about, about yourself and other coaches and how many of you um, are in the gym on the, on the session um, every day? Like? Uh, most days during the week, there's two coaches on hand. And Sunday morning, because we do a lot of the, uh, the sparring as well, we normally have three to four coaches, including myself, on a Sunday morning. There's uh, myself, my father, Harry Holland, Alan Bamford, and uh, Ricky Heavens, and also uh, there's Mark uh, Morrison, who works with the, the bigger guys, the heavyweights. He's a big... He's an ex-heavyweight himself. Um, um, John, uh, were any of famous British boxers uh, started uh, started their career here, or um, or is there any any big names coming to the gym? We've uh, we've had a lot of big names coming to the gym over the years, already established. I mean, mo most notably, as you know, Barry Jones. He had just um, when he first come, he just actually retired from the boxing, having been the WBO uh, super featherweight champion of the world. And he he still comes, and also Barry still helps out with the others. Uh, the others, as, as I mentioned, Aldi Harrison has been to the gym. Uh, the the other boxers that were now are now coming through, I think they, they'd be big names later on, but their work's in progress. They're making their way up in the amateur game. Uh, the the ones at the moment are Archie Hutchins. He's boxed for England. Uh, also, uh, Mikel Rook started here. He's he's regular appearances for England in the amateur um, in the amateur side of the sport. We also uh, we've also had. Oh, I just trying to think. Um, uh, coming coming through the ranks, Will McDermott, William, who, who you see today, he's boxed in Las Vegas for uh, for London. He was actually on the same team as Anthony Joshua uh, before he became the uh, Olympic gold medalist and 
also uh, Shane Westlake he boxed on the uh, in the Vegas in Las Vegas as well so there's there's some uh, good talented youngsters coming through the ranks um, John um, um, are you taking any 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 part of, of any um, amateur tournaments um, and is it is it just here in UK or, or anywhere in Europe and um, if you are um, what, what are um, your achievements uh, we've we've been to uh, Denmark in a couple of uh, tournaments championships in which our boxers have done very well um, my own son and my, my nephew my own son Reese and my nephew Shane they both uh, got gold medals out there it, the other fighters as I've named William, William McDermott and Mikhail Rook they both come back with uh, gold medals we're hoping to uh, go out in this October they have another tournament pending so we're hoping to go out there and and uh, go even better than what we've already done um, um, John, how many how many fighters you have in this in this club? Um, is there any professional fighters, um, amateurs, and and I know the gym's open for kids as well. Yes, we we have every standard of uh, boxers all the way through. We have uh, now I think we we're up to fifteen carded fighters. That's um, fifteen fighters that got uh, an ABA car to uh, to fight on the amateur circuit we also got uh, two professionals coming in the gym as well has trained for many years one was here uh, this morning darren mckenna he's uh, he's a regular on the professional circuit he's had about 20 20 fights now and we have uh, darren cordona he's He's inactive at the moment through injury, but he's a uh, promising uh, pros young prospect. Um, just want to let everyone know this gym is open to, to anyone, um, regardless to age or, or nationality or level of uh, experience. Um, this gym is like one, one really big family.